are you just gonna burn down your career and take me with you? Coin flip? Get out of here. Um, I would just love for you to go into the origins of the idea for the show and how it evolved over time as different collaborators came on board, either in the writer's room or in the cast. My experience of all of it started about two years ago. Bill Lawrence called me, cold call, and said, hey man, uh, I, I would love to try to find a show to do together. And so that's a very lucky call to get and I was really excited about it. And so. Um, as you know, I had done TV for a really long time and I wasn't really in a rush to jump onto another TV show. Um, so we, we bandied about a few ideas, um, but none of them were quite right. And then he and Brett Goldstein called me and they pitched me this idea um, for Shrinking about a therapist who was going through a nervous breakdown privately while continuing to try to treat uh, patients. and. That seemed like a really, uh, gr first of all, it's just a great premise for comedy. And then also it was this um, mix of tones, which is what I love most, you know, where you're, you're, you're moving between comedy and drama with these sort of indistinguishable lines and you're laughing and next thing you know, you're crying. And that's my experience, what life is like. And so that's where it started. And then the thing that I thought would be fun for me character wise was I, I told them like, if I've noticed something, it's that people seem to really think I'm a good guy. I've tricked them, I've really tricked them. So we should use that superpower and push this character towards unreliability and unlikability and have some faith that it's gonna be okay. That um, I think like the more unhinged we can make him, the funniest this will be. And and they trusted me and, and I think it's turned out really well. And do you enjoy playing a character that's not like a character that you've played in the past? Part of the appeal for me of doing this job in general, which I hadn't zeroed in on into my, until my 30s, is that um, this is all time in my life. So I should be using each one of these projects, which take a long time to do, you're dedicating a huge part of your life to, to some learning and some personal growth. Like it should be as much about me exploring something on behalf of the audience uh, as possible.